In 1974, farmers in China's Shanxi province digging for water, struck something unexpected, a clay head. Beneath their fields an entire army had lain hidden for over 2,000 years, the Terracotta Army, built to guard China's first emperor Qin Shi Huang. For centuries, local legends spoke of a cursed land, but no one imagined the scale of what was buried. The emperor who ordered this army was both a unifier and a tyrant, forging a nation and building the first Great Wall. In his quest for immortality, he created a vast underground kingdom, with the clay soldiers as its most famous guardians. The discovery stunned the world, thousands of life-sized warriors, each armed and arrayed in battle formation. There were archers, infantry, charioteers and generals, each figure a snapshot of ancient military might. As excavations continued, more pits revealed cavalry, high command, and even an unfinished section, hinting at the emperor's sudden death. This was more than art, it was a declaration that the emperor's rule would extend beyond death. The silent army was built to protect him in the afterlife, ensuring his dominion for eternity. The world watched in awe as the scale and ambition of the project became clear. The Terracotta Army was not just a monument, it was a statement of power, fear, and the desire for immortality. Each statue stood as a testament to the Emperor's vision and the labor of thousands. The discovery redefined our understanding of ancient China's capabilities. The Silent Army, once a secret, now stood as a symbol of a civilization's reach. The Emperor's ambition was immortalized in clay, his legacy unearthed for the world to see. The Terracotta Army became a bridge between past and present, a silent force finally revealed. What lay beneath the earth was not just history, it was a story waiting to be told. The silent army had awakened and its secrets were about to change everything, the world would never look at ancient China the same way again. As archaeologists pieced together the shattered soldiers, a mystery emerged, no two faces were the same. Each warrior had unique features, youthful or aged, calm or fierce, with distinct hairstyles and expressions. The detail was astonishing, from the armor's studs to the treads on their shoes. Were these idealized soldiers or portraits of real men? Scholars long believed the bodies were mass-produced with details added by artisans for efficiency, but the diversity of faces was hard to dismiss as mere artistic flair. Long, round, broad and narrow faces, each seemed too specific, too personal. The army was a beautiful, impersonal monument, yet the individuality lingered. The question persisted, were these the faces of actual soldiers? The silent army kept its secrets, standing as a symbol of imperial might. The identities of the men immortalized in clay were lost to time. The diversity of the faces hinted at stories untold. The terracotta army was more than a display of power, it was a puzzle of identity. Each face invited speculation about the lives behind the clay. The mystery of the million faces remained, challenging our understanding of ancient China. The silent army stood, enigmatic and unresolved. The question of who they were, endured, waiting for new answers. The Terracotta Army's greatest secret was not its size but its individuality. In 2025, Project Chin launched a new era of exploration, using light and algorithms instead of shovels. The mission created a complete digital archive of every Terracotta warrior. This was about more than preservation, it was about unlocking ancient secrets with modern technology. Archaeologists, historians and computer scientists joined forces, aiming to reveal what the clay had hidden for millennia. At the heart of the project was artificial intelligence. For decades study relied on the human eye, slow and subjective. AI offered speed, precision and the ability to see patterns invisible to us. Advanced 3D scanning captured every detail of each statue, creating digital twins with sub-millimeter accuracy. Non-invasive techniques ensured the fragile warriors were unharmed. Each scan produced millions of data points, forming a rich, detailed model. The project marked a paradigm shift. Ancient art met cutting-edge technology. The AI became a tireless assistant, comparing faces, armor and tool marks across thousands of figures. Project Chin was a bet that technology could finally reveal the men behind the clay masks. The silent army was about to speak through data. The process began with mobile scanners, capturing every angle of the silent soldiers. Powerful computers stitched the data into seamless 3D models, virtual warriors that could be studied without risk. These digital twins held more information than the naked eye could see. AI, using facial recognition technology, analyzed the models for key landmarks, eyes, noses, jaws. It measured features with microscopic precision, creating unique biometric profiles for each soldier.
The AI also identified armor types, hairstyles, and tool marks, classifying warriors by rank and workshop. Researchers built a massive database asking complex questions about patterns and connections. The collaboration united archaeologists, engineers, data scientists, and historians. This was a non-invasive digital excavation, peeling back time with photons and processing power. The team could now probe the statues for secrets without ever touching them. The silent army was finally beginning to reveal its story. After months of scanning, the AI delivered a stunning verdict. Comparing biometric profiles of thousands of figures, it found no duplicates, no evidence of reused molds. The probability of such diversity by chance was nearly zero. The terracotta warriors were not idealized, they were portraits of real people. Subtle asymmetries unique to real human faces were present in the clay. Each statue was a memorial to a specific soldier. The army was no longer anonymous, it was a tribute to individuals. Imagine ancient workshops, artists capturing each man's likeness in clay. This was mass portraiture, not just mass production. The emperor took his men into the afterlife, each one recognized for his service. The scale of this tribute is unparalleled in history. The AI uncovered a deeply human story of identity and remembrance. The Terracotta Army became a personal, not just imperial, legacy. The AI's analysis revealed another secret, the faces belonged to many ethnic groups. By clustering facial features, the AI identified patterns matching different peoples from across the Qin Empire. The army was a mosaic, Han faces but also those from the west, south and northern steppes. The Qin Empire was a multi-ethnic superpower, not a monolith. The army that unified China was made up of many peoples. The Terracotta Army reflected this diversity a united nations of ancient warriors. Each face told a story of conquest, assimilation and empire. The emperor didn't just conquer, he incorporated and unified. Placing diverse faces in his tomb symbolized his rule overall. The AI provided objective, data-driven evidence of this diversity. For the first time we see the faces of a forgotten world, immortalized in clay. The Terracotta Army is a census of an ancient multicultural empire. The terracotta warriors were once painted in vibrant colors, reds, purples, greens, blues. Most of this color vanished after excavation, lost to time and air. Project Chin's digital imaging brought these lost hues back to life. Hyperspectral cameras detected chemical traces of original pigments even where no color remained. The AI reconstructed the army's true appearance, robes of purple silk, red linen, lacquered armor, lifelike faces. The digital restoration revealed a dazzling, vivid spectacle, not a somber gray force. Imaging also uncovered hidden inscriptions, maker's marks, workshop names, even individual artisans. These details revealed a highly organized system of production and quality control. Every piece was tracked, every artisan accountable. The digital archive restored lost artistry and revealed the human hands behind the army. The terracotta warrior's true splendor was finally seen again. The Terracotta Army is priceless, but fragile. Exposure to the modern world brings new risks. Temperature, humidity, and tourism threaten their survival. Project Chin's digital twins are now guardians for the guardians. High-resolution models provide a perfect record of each statue's condition. AI can detect microscopic changes, flagging cracks or pigment loss before they worsen. This allows for early intervention and better conservation. The digital archive ensures the army's survival, even in disaster, every piece can be restored from its blueprint. Virtual reality brings the army to the world, letting anyone explore the pits and study the faces. Technology has given a voice to these silent sentinels. What began with farmers digging for water became a union of archaeology and AI. We now know these are portraits of real men from a diverse empire in their original colors. The terracotta army story is written in clay, stone and now, in data. With science we are finally learning how to read it.